Hey, it's Melissa K, and I am back with a, another healthy ear video. Um, don't forget to click the like button and subscribe to the channel. These are the twists that I did from day eight, right? And I didn't take them out right away. I could have, I could have taken it. My plan was to take them out the next day, but um, I got busy and the style that I had with the bang I thought was kind of cute, so I just left it. All right, so I haven't done anything to this, to these twists since the last um, retwist. So this is my first time taking it out. And I'm just showing you guys how I do it. My hair definitely needs um, a trim. My ends are um, um, kind of straggly or I'm getting um, hair. Like I know when I need a trim because my hair feels, I can feel the roughness on the ends, you know, and like the straggly, like right here. But, so I'll be showing you guys how I twin, trim my natural hair because it's definitely harder to trim than when you have relaxed hair or a flat ironed hair. All right, guys, so it seems like I got all the, the two, the two strand twist out. I'm just trying to feel. All right, and so what I do, I will basically just divide them, each twist. Strand. I'm going to divide them. I'm going to try not to manipulate them too much. So what I'm doing is just trying to just give my hair some body. I really can't tell what's going on in the back very well, so I have to get my mirror. And guys, excuse my mirror, it's kind of it's cracked. So I gotta buy a new one, but in the meantime, I'll use that until I get another one. It looks really good for the most part. Because I don't wear my hair out a lot, um, like this all over, like I usually have it like twisted up somehow in an updo of some sort. My hair, I notice like um, when I try to wear it out, my hair is not shaped right. It, like it folds all kind of weird ways. So I really have to get the the little um, my little comb, you know, my pick comb, my big comb, my big tooth comb and try to like really shape my hair because it's not, because I'm not used to wearing my hair all out. So I feel like it's new for my hair to do this. And so, um, yeah, it just, it just makes it hard, that's all, for me to shape it because my hair is not like, it doesn't lay easily. Like being all out, it doesn't lay right usually. Okay, so the curls in the front came out nice. Um, I did this yesterday, I think it was afternoon, I'm not sure. It was kind of early, I think, yesterday. And um, it's been about over, it's been about a day and a half, basically, since I've twisted my hair in the front. So you can tell the difference with the twist outs from 
the old twist out to the new one. See, the old one is more frizzy. And the new one is more um, defined. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use, I actually like this Eco Styler gel. Um, I think I like um, the traditional one that first came out, I think it was called Olive Oil Eco Styler, it's in the green bottle. Um, that always worked well on my hair. I used to use that to do twist outs for wash and goes, really, wash and goes. But, and I would just saturate my hair with it and just get it to curl up naturally. But that made my hair hard and then it would flake. So it wasn't a good wash and go. Um, in the end, it wasn't really a good wash and go um, option for me. And lastly, what I'm going to do is, I think I'll just kind of touch it to the edge of it, you know. I'm going to get my big tooth comb and I'm just going to shape the hair again, kind of pick it like I did the last time, because I saw there was a little bit, there's some spaces in there that I can't see. Same thing in the front, I decided to take out the flat twist that was in the front this time, because I'm getting down to the wire with my hair, and I'm gonna be probably washing it soon again, because I need to trim my ends I'm gonna look at the back one more time. Um, I'm trying not to touch it too much because that's what causes the frizzing or whatever. So, Alright, so I feel like right here it's like really stiff and like lifting up. So I'm gonna try to figure out how I can kind of play with this for it to kind of stay a certain way. That's why I want to start wearing my hair down more and stop doing those updos because I really feel like my hair should be shaped a lot better with me being natural for so long, because I've always done updos, or had like half my hair up and down. So I never could really get with my hair being down all at one time, but once you start, it's hard to shape. I just be feeling like my hair looks like I look like a muffin. <laughs> so that's why I'm starting to do these up down. Plus I want to give my edges, um, I feel like, I don't want to be pulling on my on the sides of my hair as much um, and that going forward because I, I noticed that it started getting thin and so I feel like it needs to be just out, you know, so. So I really feel like there's one little area that's kind of like puffed out and everything else matches. It's just this one little frizz area. So um, what I'm going to do is add a little bit, um, baby, a little bit of the baby whisk on here. I don't 
don't mind it being frizzy, but not when I first untwist it, because I like the, I like my hair to look uniform when I first untwist it. And then like, as the days go on, I don't care anymore. But I do enjoy my first twist out, <laughs> you know. to my three week mark. Yeah. And I'm not gonna do the bobby pin today. I'm just gonna leave that out. But yeah, so this twist out should get me to my three week mark, I think. And um, when I get to my three week mark, I'm gonna probably wash my hair. Because I do sometimes, I do my hair, like I wash my hair, I think I said this already, but usually every three to four weeks. And last but not least, I'm going to just spray it with some oil sheen just because it's been a few days since I applied product to this twist out overall. It looks slightly, just a little bit dull. Okay. All right, I'm gonna do my 360 again, right, as you can see. I'll be washing my hair in the next video. There are some techniques that I didn't show you guys previously that I do. I'll be blow drying my hair, um, showing you guys how I trim my ends naturally. And uh, yeah, I'll be doing dyeing. So I have a lot of more hair videos coming up, all right? So thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next healthy year video. Take care. Bye.